Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 24th of February 1848, amidst the revolutions that were beginning to sweep across the continent, King Louis Philippe of France abdicated the throne. Having come to power following the July Revolution in 1830, he became known as the Citizen King and the Bourgeois Monarch, but his rule saw conditions deteriorate for many in the French population. Louis Philippe came from the more liberal Orléans branch of the House of Bourbon and had even been a member of the Radical Jacobin Club in the early years of the French Revolution. Having fled the country during the Reign of Terror, he returned to France during the Bourbon Restoration. Following the abdication of King Charles X in 1830, Louis Philippe was then proclaimed King of the French by the popularly elected Chamber of Deputies. Louis Philippe's reign began positively, but over time he faced mounting opposition due to favouring landowners over bourgeois industrialists and consequently reduced the electoral franchise to only about 1% of the population. This led to a largely middle-class reform movement who, by the summer of 1847, had begun to hold banquets at which they began to form an organised opposition to the monarchy. A banquet to mark the birthday of George Washington on the 22nd of February 1848 was prohibited by the government and this provided the spark for civil unrest as people rushed to man barricades in the streets. The following day, the 23rd of February, the Prime Minister, François-Pierre Guillaume Guizot, resigned. Following this, a crowd marched on the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, where 52 people died. The next day, Louis-Philippe himself abdicated and fled across the Channel to Britain, where he died just two years later. Meanwhile, back in France the opposition proclaimed the Second Republic. <laughs>